Hey guys, today we're celebrating 300 subscribers. I know I'm a little bit late to the party, but what can you do? Life and guess, right? So I decided to do a QA. Uh, I'm not gonna deny it. Some questions are from the internet, some questions are from you, the viewers, and some questions are just things that I thought that you would love. So let's get into the video. But first, I need to say something because it was an amazing experience and I'm gonna tell you right now. So I did my eyebrows for the first time at home. Can you believe it? Are they good? Okay, so this is a picture of me with... <laughs> oh, I can't speak without doing my eyebrows. And this is me with the eyebrows. So what do you think? They look fabulous now. I mean, they're like caterpillars in that photo. Now they're like semi-caterpillars. So I'm fine with that. Anyway, let's get into the video. The first question is, what is your biggest fear? My biggest fear? You know what my biggest fear is? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Uh, are we la talking like phobia or are we talking like fear fear? I think it's the same shit. Uh, fear. Uh, I don't want to say like the most common thing, but my fear is probably like heights or, or planes. I hate planes but for passing. I just hate them because yes, they're the safest transportation. But once you're in the air, if something goes wrong, you are, you, you, you're gone. You, your life is ended. If something goes wrong and that plane goes down, you're out. You're out. Well, it depends if they can save it, but you know what I'm talking about. Okay, next question. What is your favorite type of car? Well, this is where I reveal my favorite car, to be honest. And my favorite car is one that has four wheels and a steering wheel. Yes, that's my type of car and that works from A to B because uh, if not, it's not a car that's pretty much my type of car you can give me a second handed car that is trash but if it works, it works and takes me to places I'm fine with that lesson, I'm not an expensive Gucci girl over here anyway, next question if that's also anything for you guys to be honest who is your celebrity cross? god damn it I knew that was gonna come in I just knew it. So, um, are we talking guys? Are we talking women? Are we talking, what, what are we talking, like, in general? So, okay. So, my first cross was probably James from Big Time Rush. Uh, and after that, I progressively moved to Harry Styles when he was younger. Um, and then now, I don't have any crosses at the moment. Like, it's, it's genuinely... If I find somebody attractive, I'll be like, damn, slap that ass. I'm joking, I'm, it's, it's a fucking joke. Uh, no, I, I don't know. I don't know, please, please don't cancel me. Uh, do you have any regrets? Yes, and this is a big one, I've never talked about it. But I came here to America in 2017. So I'm not gonna calculate my age right now. Uh, but I was 18 or 19 at the time pretty young to be honest uh, and I didn't know about Planned Parenthood they offer trans HRT things and I didn't know that so me as a stupid person waited until 23 to transition when I could have done it way before but to be honest I don't regret it but at the same time I do uh, in the UK they have it worse um, I, 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 I literally know people from the UK because I'm from the UK and uh, to take hormones in the UK. Let me tell you, it's a whole process. People wait five years just to see a person that decides if you take it or not. And oh my freaking God, it can go wrong in many ways. So yeah, in a way, I'm happy to be here. Um, sure, it's not free, uh, but at least you can access it quicker than over there, okay? In my experience, thank you very much. Next question. Never have I ever kissed my best friend's girlfriend's boyfriend. So, okay. So let, let me tell you a quick story, okay? My best friend is gay. And no, then that question doesn't apply to me because I haven't kissed uh, his boyfriend because we are not in the same country anyway. So that doesn't apply to me. So next question, you thought I had drama there, but I don't, I don't have drama. Okay, next question. 
Uh, never have I ever been drunk. Okay. So, this is a, a huge storyline to be honest. So, in the summer of 2017, 16, uh, before I moved to the US, I was in the south of Madrid. And this is, uh, yes, I had my lung condition, but it wasn't as bad as now. And uh, one friend and I decided to buy vodka and Aquarius that you don't have over here. It's like lemonade, I guess. Uh -uh, I don't think you know. And we mixed it up. And I got drunk that night. And the next day at 7 a.m., I was surfing. So, uh, you know, uh, drunk doesn't apply to me. I didn't even have a hangover. I was so disappointed. And that was the last time I got drunk. Um, now, if I get a sip, I may get drunk a little bit faster because I haven't drunk in years. And I tend not to because of my medications. But that's another story. Uh, this is from Instagram. How are you? I'm doing fine, thank you for asking. Like, I could be worse, but thank you for asking. And the other one, Hormone Regimen Dose. So I don't know what you imply with that, but let me tell you about my hormones, okay? There's gonna be another video apart from this one, after this one. Um, so basically, I've, I've, this year has been a little bit complicated with my hormones because I've been in the hospital a lot. And obviously I haven't been taking uh, my hormones correctly because uh, depression set in and then I was doubting myself. So yeah, it's, I don't count like I've been a full two years. So yeah, that's the thing. A regimen is 100, 100 of spirolactone and progesterone and estradiol is 2 milligrams in the morning and 2 milligrams at night. But that's gonna change because I wanna do injections because I always forget to take my damn medication in the morning because I am running late to college because my motherfucking mind is like I wanna sleep more and then the alarm goes off and I'm like Ugh. so yeah it's, it's pretty much insane at that moment uh yes so let me tell you like if you like this energy in the video I actually found the energy today to do it like this uh the reason why is because I'm feeling better uh if you like more like this I know it's more sloppy and more energetic. Let me know. Um, the reason why is because I told you I'm feeling better. Um, so in this case, if you like this type of content, please subscribe, comment below, share with friends. And uh, yes, so if you like it, the other thing I was wondering, if you like this type of content like this, like I'm doing right now in my bed, uh, it's gonna take me more to put up content because I know I'm, mo I'm mostly sick most of the days. Uh, to make a video like this will take me a little bit more of an effort for my lungs uh, but I am willing to put that in, but it will be less content and more quality basically so hope you enjoyed this video uh, I already said what I need to say and I'll see you guys in the next video bye